today we're learning how to read a Barton chart. If you look and see we have a 2,000 pound chart. Because we have a 2,000 pound spring. Your red pin is always going to be your differential. Your blue pin is always going to be your static. If you have a black pin on there, that's going to be your temperature. You can get that off of the side of the separator as well as your static if you want to check it to cross-reference it with your Barton meter. And your pressure will be right there. Normally you want to check it on your line though, right before your Daniels. Anyways, back to the Barton meter. As you see the differentials jumping up and down as it dumps water and oil. So what you're going to want to do is read in between the strokes. So take from where the bottom of the stroke is to the top of the stroke and put it right in the middle. So we're stroking right at oh 20 we'll call it 20 increments for now because it's barely hitting 40 so it's halfway in between um, your differential is gonna read in um, fours and your static pressure is gonna read in increments of 30 so don't let it confuse you with fives or tens and try to stay away from percentage charts always do static times differential equals the squared button times your coefficient. Your coefficient will vary according to your orifice. Right now we're using a 1.25 and our coefficient is 8.07 but you'll want to look that up on your coefficient chart. Don't forget to move your decimal three places to the forward.